Hi, I'm Eric from Crandall Office Furniture, and today we're going to take a look at the seat pan movement on this Steelcase Leap V2. Now, it's going to be the same on a V1 and a V2, but we're going to show you on a V2 today. So let's take a look. Now, the seat pan slides along a set of glides and rails, and what that does is that allows that seat pan to move freely. And when that happens, there's going to be a small amount of movement, even when it's not being adjusted. Let's take a look at an acceptable amount of movement in the seat pan. Give us one million likes and subscribe. Now I took the seat pan off so we can get a little closer look at what I was talking about. Right here along the bottom of the seat pan are the two plastic bushings that slide along the two plastic glides on the frame of the chair. Now this will allow for a small amount of movement. Thanks for watching today's video about the Leap V2 seat pan movement. If you have any questions, make sure to contact us at crandalloffice.com. We'll be happy to help you in any way that we can. If you found this video helpful, make sure to hit that like and subscribe button down below. And as always, have a good day. Hi, I'm Eric from Crandall Office Furniture. No. Oh, it's going to be the same. It, no. <sighs> now the seat pan is adjust. Is it? How did I say it again? One million likes. I like that. That's funny. <laughs>